recipe for the ratchet. I <laughs> did. <laughs> so, my dad taught me this recipe. So there are no real measurements. My dad was just like, here, a little bit of semolina, the same amount of flour. <gasps> Let's add some more semolina. Who cares? About a tablespoon of salt. <laughs> Je suis dans le fridge. <laughs> Vraiment pas, on voit même pas ta face. <laughs> Alright. Sick. Then some instant yeast, or just yeast, I don't know, he didn't specify, just yeast. I think any yeast works. <laughs> Let's see. I think a, a tablespoon sounds about right, right? A tablespoon of yeast. The sketchiest bread recipe. Maybe a little more. <laughs> Maybe a little more yeast, you're right. But we don't want to taste it to taste like yeast. Alright, and then to activate the yeast. Do you want to know what activates the yeast? Well, a little bit of sugar, but I'm never sure how much sugar either. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's say about a tablespoon. <laughs> We're gonna add little by little until it's like about the consistency. About three water. Because soon we're gonna use the space right here that I pre-cleaned. Okay, water. This is the scary part because if you add too much water, then it's like you're done. It's you might as well like throw away everything. Because you can't add the flour, like more stuff in, because it won't be mixed properly. I hope I didn't forget any ingredients, but Sometimes, when I was a kid, he would give me like a piece of the bread, like a little, like, you know, like this, and then I would make tiny bread, but like in, in shape of a heart or a star. It was pretty cool. <laughs> Good story, right? I know. All right, a little bit more water, because it's dry as hell. Just a little bit. Just like, whoop. And then the hardest part after that is doing it like, you know, the kneading, I think it's called kneading. Because, like, my dad taught me, but didn't really tell me <laughs> what to look for. It's just like, oh yeah, you feel it when it's ready. Which, I don't know about you, but to me, that's not really precise. Alright, just try to get more. When you're done doing that, we're gonna put a whole bunch of flour on the table. Ooh, I put water. You guys probably saw that. I didn't see it. I think that's okay. What do you think? <laughs> yeah, I like eating the dough. And then sprinkle. Isn't that nice? Hell yeah. And then you start doing that thing that like no one really understands, but after a while you start looking like you know what you're doing. I don't think I'm there yet. Alright, so this like's supposed to take eight minutes according to papa, so... Let's see if Matt can come and help me out. You know? Qu'est-ce que je fais? Il va falloir que tu lis un peu, mais pas vraiment. Tu fasses comme ça, ouais. Chris! T'es cute, toi? Non. Ok, mon père, là, mon père, là, il est riche en tabarnak. Tu écoutes plus. Ok, j'ai fucking chaud. I think this is good. What do you think? I don't care what you think. Boom. Oh, I'm kind of dumb. Yep. Cause you're supposed to like let it rest for a while so that it like puffs up. So I think I'm gonna do that. Milady. No. Oui. Milady. Quoi? 
so excited. <laughs> so, I'm gonna cover your bread and wait approximately an hour. I did that already. Alright, now, I don't know why my dad does this, but he pokes holes in it with the fork, so we're gonna do that. It's kinda nice. Oh yeah. Don't you feel like it's enough? <laughs> you put it in the oven. For 15 minutes, baby. Timer. 15. Start. It's like... It looks pretty good. Okay, it's definitely undercooked. Still good though. I'm gonna pop it back in. People at home don't have to fight when they're going to the grocery store <laughs> to get some bread. You just do it at home. I mean, you still have to go to the grocery store to get flour and yeah, semolina. People and don't yeast. fight to get flour. But, but they will. Oh my god, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one. Please like, subscribe, share. Who's <laughs> on?